Hi, I'm Alan Belden, head golf professional at the Worcester Country Club. I'm here today to talk to you about the importance of properly warming up before heading to the first tee. So often we see amateurs head straight to the first tee without spending any time at the range, taking practice swings, or doing any sort of stretching. I have done nothing this morning to stretch out or take any practice swings. I have a launch monitor here and I have a 7 iron. I'm going to take a swing right now, see what the numbers look like without properly preparing. That particular shot went 149 yards and that's carry distance in the air uh, and that's without doing any sort of stretching uh, before hitting that shot. I'm now going to take a couple minutes to stretch and get warmed up and I'll be back to you to see how the numbers change. Okay, we're back. I've taken the last few minutes to stretch out get my muscles loose, I've stretched my arms, my back, I've taken a few practice swings, all in an effort to get the muscles and the body ready to go play golf. I still have the 7 iron here in my hand. We're going to take a swing and see what the numbers look like after we've had a chance to warm up. That particular 7 iron went 164 yards in the air, which is uh, about 15 yards further than the original swing that I took before I took any time to warm up. So if your habit is to run directly to the first tee without taking any time to get loose before you play, I strongly suggest that you change that so that the first two or three holes on the golf course are not spent warming up, scores will come down, the game will improve. If you have a question about this or any other aspect of your golf game, please see myself or any of the professionals in the shop.